All right. James doesn't understand. We're stopped. You can sorry for the bad lighting. Uh, we're stopped because we're in a really long line. James is like he thinks we're stopped at a red light, but we're gonna we're like at a place with like. Uh, That's what you're done. Uh, yeah, you're gonna do a limo. Well, if you get a group of people and no one has to drive, you can just stick your head out there. We're at, like, I guess, what would you call this, like, a tradition, like, famous, like... For our area, it's, it's a, uh, the neighborhood is, I guess you could say famous. They're, they're required, if you live in this neighborhood, to put up lights every Christmas. I don't, I because don't... Because the neighborhood basically does this, everyone oh. comes around in the DFW area. Um, so, oh. you, they come around the entire neighborhood. Um, they, I don't know if it's technically forced because I know sometimes we've seen one or two houses. It's highly, see, highly, I don't, highly I don't recommended think that you put up your lights. Yeah, and um, H, I think in their there's HOA. There's HOA, and if you don't, you probably have to pay a fee. So I most, don't know about I'm that. assuming. I, I don't I've know. read about it before. I think most people who move in here know that they're going to put lights up. And then they, and they, they um, are told some that some are very big. Some are. I mean, they go all they go all out basically. This is not like your normal. You know, people put lights out. I mean, this is some people have. It's hooked. To, their lights are hooked to a radio station, a local station that they rented out, and it, their lights match with the song. James, it goes on. you have to have patience. We have uh, to wait. These people have like it's. It's amazing what they put up every year. It's. It's very all out. And, and there's multiple, multiple streets, and there's a line that everyone kind of follows. And, and you try to go around, and you go to the net. And, it's hard to see everything, but I remember it, it's a we're, lot. we're doing this on a Saturday, <laughs> yeah, so which, we have never done it on a Saturday. I, I have. I, I have not, and I see why not. Sorry, I'm not I'm driving and I'm trying. I see why I have it now. There's a reason why I probably should have said let's do it Sunday. Uh, never mind. I'm not driving. <laughs> we should have done it Sunday or during the week Wednesday. <laughs> just oh. a day. I I just mean like a Tuesday or a Wednesday. That wouldn't be that busy. Sun Saturday is probably the absolute worst day we could have done to do this. Absolute worst. Even Sundays are busy, but like, I don't know why people are honking. It's like they know that people. No, I, I guarantee you, there's someone that either doesn't live here, is visiting a friend, doesn't understand why there's this many people. And they're like, what's going on? And then they look up. Oh, like I don't know how bad if they live over here in this area, unless they're very new. Well, actually, when we first moved here, my mom I and I, we were house. like, why is there so many yeah. people over here? And the then, only thing I would say is that if I did live in these houses, they're nice houses. I would hate, though, to live here every year because if I tried to go out to eat dinner and come back home, I wouldn't be able to get to my house. I would be, I would, would have to. It would take probably like an hour. And there's no way you could do uh, Uber Eats because they wouldn't get to your house. No. It's like, How do you now? James, it's going to take a little bit before we can yeah. get in there. You're at the wait. Patience, my child. No, I don't. I don't want. Okay, we're gonna turn the car around. <laughs> yeah, Hannah. Enjoying looking at lights, James? Buddies. 
see that? Isn't that cool?